A very important part of skincare we never really talk about is skin fast. Now, what does skin fast actually mean? From the name, you should already know what we are talking about. Skin fast is the phase where you do not apply anything on your face for like a week or two weeks or even more. But personally, I do it for like two weeks or a week. The highest I've actually gone to be fair is nine days without actually applying anything on my face. And that is very essential to always do. One, because it is essential to give our skin a little bit of break once in a while as much as skincare is very important as much as skincare is very essential for us to have an even skin tone to glow to radiate and all that sometimes it is very important to give our skin a little bit of break what do i mean our skin produces its own moisture our skin produces its own oil our skin literally repairs itself and sometimes it's essential to leave our skin to do those work on its own without adding any extra thing to it when it comes to skin fast the only thing you're permitted to do of course is just to use a gentle mouth cleanser and wash your face and go on with your day sincerely and honestly speaking this is very important if you have noticed that your skincare products have not been working for you maybe what you just need is a skin fast leave your skin to just be for like a week or two weeks and believe me when you get back to your routine it's going to be very very easier and better and actually going to get the job done by the job done i mean your skincare products getting the job done one thing about me is that there is no product i have used that is actually used to my skin why because i never allow my skin or a product to now get used to my skin or my skin get used to a particular product or even a particular active to the extent that it doesn't work on my skin again why because i've bombarded my skin with the product that my skin now is so used to it that it doesn't work anymore on my skin imagine that situation whereby let's say azelic acid doesn't work on your skin again because your skin have built the highest tolerance when it comes to azelic acid meaning your skin is not surprised when you use it again nothing about it intrigues your skin again that's very bad giving your skin a break is essential to build a healthy skin barrier also exactly my point sometimes our skin can be very overwhelmed from the plain plenty things that we do on it to be honest how long do we want to overwork our skin for how long do we want to apply things on our skin like our skin sometimes needs to breathe so it is essential to always go on a skin fast but before you go on a skin fast you actually need to be very sure that okay you have tried everything on your own and your skin is just not acting right maybe your skin need a break from everything your skin just needs a reset mood our skin produces its own oil our skin produces its own moisture our skin is self-repair like our skin repairs itself just like we say our v is self-cleansing that we don't need all those plain things that we do to cleanse our v area that's the same way our skin is self-repair produces its own oil produces its own moisture produces its own collagen as well as just maintaining our skin on its own by giving your skin a fast is you just allowing your skin to get its balance again and restoring it to its natural state yes so it's very important that you practice skin fast this is one important routine in my skincare journey actually like i don't joke with the period i need a break from my skincare routine like i really don't joke with it i i am very cautious not to use anything on my skin even down to a sunscreen because i'll be inside so it is essential that if you're going to have the skin fast you should be when you're inside when you're not under the sun so that if you apply your sunscreen and your skin got burnt do you understand what i mean so it is very essential to just give your skin a break our skin needs to breathe ah some of you you are choking your skin do you know there's something like over hydrating of our skin like our skin can drown <laughs> this may sound funny but that's actually fact there's also something like over over hydrating of our body when my brother that is into medicine was telling me that i can drown myself if i don't know because i was drugging so much water like there was this phase i was trying to be so healthy so i was drinking lots and lots of water i found i was very sure that i over drank more than four liters or five liters they say we should drink it so he looked at me i was like what's this in your dinner i can't drown myself he was like do you even know what is drowning yourself like you're giving your body excess water that it doesn't need so sometimes we are giving our skin excess active excess product that it doesn't need so it needs a break it genuinely genuinely needs a break i remember when i actually first did this skin fast was when i used to battle acne actually yes though that time i wasn't using the right products but it was when i gave myself a break from trying many many things to clear my acne that my skin acted right for the first time in a long time like i was like i'm not doing it again 
I'm not rubbing anything again. Let my, it's just weird that I don't have pictures of when I actually had acne in this life. Like, it's very crazy. If not, y'all be shocked at the kind of acne I used to have. Like, oh my God, I can never forget the day I literally looked at myself in the mirror. Like, like this, I'm looking at myself in the mirror. I wanted to scrape my forehead. It was that bad. Like, I was crying that day. I looked at myself and this is like, there was no help. There was no dermatologist to help me out. I was just dealing with everything by myself. And it was like all the effort I was putting at that time was not just working. I looked at the mirror. I was like, is it not to take a razor and just scrape out all these things? Like, won't it work? Imagine how bad the acne was for me to have thought of doing that kind of thing. So the time I now was like, you know what? Mm -mm. I'm not doing it again. Even down to the natural remedy. And believe me, when you have acne, eh, people will always have suggestions for you. People that even know nothing about skincare. So guess what? Every suggestion anybody give me that time, I will take. Even down to what I should drink, I will take it. That was the time I was like, you know what? I'm not doing it again. I'm just going to rest and give my skin a little bit of break. I think I, that was the first time I did it. And I did it for like two weeks. Yeah, that's the highest. Two weeks. And believe me, my skin just acted right. Like it was like my skin was waiting for me to now allow it to do the work that it's ought to do. Do you get what I mean? Not that it cleared the acne that time, but there was an improvement. Some of my acne is literally dried out and just disappeared. 100% until I finally used a particular product that cleared the acne for me. So it's very important that we should give our skin break to do its own work. Our skin actually have, I think I've said this, but our skin actually has its own built-in repair system whereby it can do everything that all those products we are actually giving it can do. Our skin produces its own collagen. Our skin produces its own oil. Our skin produces its own water, its own moisture, literally its own everything. Thing. Yes, skincare came into the picture and we need it now to maintain it more. But that doesn't mean that our skin can't do without it. So bombarding our skin with so much without actually giving it a break is crazy. Come on now. Like, I wish you guys understand this. That is why I say like, no product can see my skin finish. You. No matter the product it is, even down to the ones I use every day, there are some days I'll be like, rest first let this skin not get used to you how long have i been using this particular soap that you guys know on this channel ashanti papaya and honey i've used that soap now for over six years and somehow every time i use it it still does the work that is ought to do on my skin but there are some people now that it won't be working on them again there are some people that will say i use this product for this particular period of time and then it stopped working i can use ashanti for like a month the next month i'm not using it i'm looking for another product to use just a milder product literally so that my skin will reset it will long for that particular product let your skin long for extra help don't let your skin get used to it that it tends to shut down completely and just like do whatever it pleases so we need to stop overwhelming our skin and actually let our skin sometimes breathe trust me if you start taking skin fast you will see how important it is when it comes to your skincare journey to be very honest it's actually very important that we start taking skin fast just like we go on three days fast seven days fast five days fast it's not because of we want to starve ourselves but because we want to actually cleanse our body do you know that so giving your skin a fast also means you cleansing your skin just like when we go on three days fast is like also this physical aspect is just cleansing your system and letting your system become all brand new and fresh and really and like 100 percent so every fast is very important skin fast normal fast very important even down to fruit fast so take your skin fast very seriously and yeah trust me it works okay so this is just me telling you guys i just realized i've actually never talked about it so i decided to share it with you guys today so just go on that skin fast that is what your skin may need calm down with the active as much as i'm not a fan of so many active calm down with the active that you use it's also very important but yeah till next time i hope i see you guys in our next video i love you guys so much and i'll see you guys next time please do to subscribe like, share, comment. Bye.